Barrier Reef is often referred to as being a wall of boughs. Just look at all these fish around me. All these little fish, they're out here feeding on plankton. All the microscopic bits of food and even the larval forms of many reef creatures that are drifting into the reef. These orange fish that are hanging around me at the moment, these are anthias. They're the females, and this purple one, they're the males. They have a sex ratio of about one male to every 20 females. Lucky guys, there's one right there. If you look at little planktivorous fish, the eye and the mouth are very close together. Now because the eye and mouth are close together, that means you can't fit much muscle material in there. It's a very weak mouth. But when you spend your day feeding on plankton, you don't need a very strong mouth. And the other thing is that because plankton is so small, as soon as you see it, your mouth is right next door to open up and feed upon it. But the anthias are a very fast swimming fish, and you'll see that they venture out further than a lot of the other smaller species of planktivorous fish. They need speed, not for eating plankton, but to prevent them from becoming food themselves. Because out behind, Every now and then you'll get a glimpse of the big silverfish, the trevally and the barracuda. They're out there just waiting. And every now and then you can actually hear a whoosh as they come darting in to feed on them. And all the fish rush back into the reef for cover. Wherever you look, there's always a constant life and death struggle.